assalamu alaikum my dear students i hope all of you are fine and doing well so the topic here we will discuss today it is the electrolysis of water so the word electrolysis mean electrically or the use of the electricity electro word it's mean the simple electricity and the lysis mean the breaking or the simple breaking of water with the help of the electricity this is called as the electrolysis this process of the electrolysis is basically a chemical process in which the bonded elements and the compounds are dissociated by the passage of an electric current so when the electric current is passed through the any type of the compound or any element they just dissociated into their different forms so the electrolysis of water when here this takes place as we know the formula of the water is simple h2o plus when energy is applied in the form of the electricity it dissociates into the production of the hydrogen gas and the oxygen gas on both sides so this, this is the simple process of electricity use and breaking of the different molecules here we have the simple electrolytic cell that just happened in the electrolytic process so the two electrodes are just got inserted into the electrolyte solution in which the one is cathode and the other is anode here with electrolyte is present in the water now on both the sides of the electrodes on the one side here is a production of hydrogen gas on the other side here is a pro production of the oxygen gas when we just attach it to the energy source or any type of the battery so overall this is basically a redox reaction in which the oxidation is taking place at anode and the reduction process just takes place at the cathode here we have the process of electrolysis of the water in a very simple way when the electric current is just passed through the acidified water the water that is also having the acid type like H2SO4 along with that now the hydroxide ions will move towards the positive electrode that is anode and the hydrogen which is the cation it will move towards the negative electrode which is cathode and here the discharge takes place at these electrodes and the production of the oxygen and the hydrogen gas will takes place so by the passage of the electric current basically what just happened the production when here we have the water as its formula we have hoh and when electric current is passed is just break up into its two ions which the first one is hydrogen positive and the second one we have hydroxide ion as oh negative now the positive ion will move towards the opposite charge electrode which is the cathode and the hydroxide ion will move towards the anode and at a node the production of the gas oxygen will takes place because here the process of reduction at cathode and the oxidation will takes place at the anode so this is a simple process of electrolysis for the water molecule now here we have a simple description along with the electrolytic cell that is basically used for the measure the composition of water by mass so it is consisting of two electrodes the number one is anode which is having positive charge and the second one is cathode which is having the negative charge and a battery source is attached to with this so here the electrodes that we will use they may be of platinum and on the one electrode which is the anode here the production of the oxygen gas by the process of oxidation takes place and on the other hand the hydrogen gas will produced at the cathode by the process of reduction and both these is also filled up with the water molecule because here we are going to learn just the electrolysis of the water molecule now both the process of oxidation and the reduction will takes place and overall this process is called as the redox reaction re is from the reduction and ox for the oxidation so it is called as the redox reaction and on one side there is the loss of electrons 
and on the other side there is a gain of electrons and the oxidation takes place at a node and the reduction will take place at the cathode so this is the very simple process of electrolysis of water now let's have a look on the type of the chemical reaction that takes place the simple oxidation reaction that is at a node in which the hydroxyl groups as negative charge ions they will move towards the node which is having positive charge and they will produce a water molecule along with the production of the oxygen gas and they will lose the four electrons now these electrons will move towards the cathode and the reduction will take place at the cathode in which the four hydrogen ion will gain the electrons and changes into the four hydrogen atoms and these four hydrogen atoms will make the bond and produce the hydrogen gas so the overall reaction for this process that we can have is the simple water molecule is breaking up into the hydrogen gas and oxygen gas this is the simple decomposition of the water molecule and it is just happening because when we just pass out the electricity through it so the decomposition of water is a very simple process we just call it as the electrolysis process so i'm going, going to just repeat that electrolysis mean the breaking of any compound or the elements by passing out the electricity through it so this is the simple process of electricity i hope you guys understand and if you have any queries you may also ask me about that in the comment section and i will get back to you guys soon the next topic that we will discuss it is a redox reactions to recover the metals from the ores as in our previous lesson we have learned the metals recovering from their ores by the process of metallurgy that was including many of the steps but here we will learn about the type of the reaction which are basically or in reality are the redox reaction involving both the oxidation and reduction so for that time you guys keep learning and have a good day